Hi guys, uh, before I get into this video, uh, I just wanted to thank everybody for uh, 12, 13, 14, and 15,000 subscribers. It's fucking crazy. The support recently has been unreal. Uh, so, I always wanted to apologize for the lack of videos. I've been trying to record some stuff, uh, and I just really haven't been able to get any decent footage. Uh, what I've done with this video is I, I started editing up a solo survival video, but I decided... I probably I'm not going to continue on this server. Um, I, I, I don't know. It's just nothing really interesting happened after the, like the start of the, the first video. Nothing else that interesting happened. Uh, I don't really see much point in uploading uh, boring content. So what I've got in this video is just what I managed to edit together before I decided that I wasn't going to continue. Uh, it's probably the most entertaining stuff that happened. Uh, I just tried to make it into something kind of funny. You know, uh, like a short, funny uh, video. Uh, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. But yeah, um, without further ado, I guess we're going to jump into the video. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. And um, yeah, once again, thanks for all the support. Hi everyone, I'm Wilsonator, and welcome back to Rust Solo Survival. Uh, it's been a little while actually since I've done uh, any solo survival stuff, but uh, we're going to jump right in. Uh, I'm on a server that's kind of wiped not that long ago, a couple of hours, I think, maybe. But anyway, we're going to jump right in. Uh, we're not doing a trap base today, no. This is uh, just regular solo rust survival. There's someone over there. Someone over there. Fuck. What did you do? What did you do to this man? What did you do? Why did you do this? What the fuck? Why did you kill this man? Sir, please, answer my question. Do you have a microphone? Can you even hear me? Please, sir. Oh, he died. Oh, that's what happens when you run away. You die. Well, thanks for the stuff, mate. I would have helped you up if you had, uh... Decided to cooperate, but yeah, you're dead. How does that feel? <laughs> yeah, boy. So yeah, I've got no real plans. We're just gonna sort of take every every uh, victory or defeat as it comes. Um, we're gonna grab this node. I think I'm gonna go into the desert. Um, the desert's like my my bread and butter, right? I, I go to the desert and I usually do fairly well. Stick him. Got him. Then we're gonna try and get like um. A basic shit shack down, I think. Ow. That hurt. I'm gonna get a basic shit shack down. I don't know what sort of base I wanna build. Um, probably like some sort of tower. I don't know. A tower of power, I guess. Could be interesting. Could be interesting. We'll have to see. I, I, I don't know. I'm gonna just go for something. Something straight out of the mind uh, and into the world. Uh, we're gonna probably build a sim like around this area, kinda. Um, probably not by that big base over there. Maybe somewhere around here. Uh, we expertly execute that bear. We now have got enough for more than enough uh, low grade fuel. Should be enough for two furnaces, I think. Oh, fuck. Right, guys, we're we'll armored up. Fuck, we're dead. Yep, we're fucked. Have mercy, please. Have mercy, sir. I've just started. I'm just trying to get myself set up, you know. Have mercy. Please. Do you speak English? Or are you just uh, scared of talking online? I'll take it as you're, you're scared. You know, you don't have to fucking throw everything on the ground. Holy shit. You're an arsehole, mate. Fucking people in this game. They're so fucking. They're so tryhardy. Oh, yeah, he's a Russian, look, of course. Well, yeah, I'm gonna loot you. I'm not gonna say anything, even though you're clearly trying to speak to me. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna strafe back and forth and loot you, and then I'm gonna fucking throw a pickaxe in your face. Fucking prick. Didn't realize you were playing the game competitively. Holy fuck. Back for a uh, second round of death and, and failure and misery. Oh, yeah. Look, there we go. That guy's got a gun or some shit. I oh, know he's got a bow. Excuse me, sir. Can you help me? Can you help me, sir? Listen, listen. I've got nothing. Why, why are you scared? 
Why are you scared? I've got nothing. Listen, I've just been murdered, right? I've just been murdered. I need your help, right? If you could pr provide me 30 bone fragments, I'll be forever in your debt. I'll give you a gun, all right? I, mean, I don't actually have a gun, but when I do have a gun, I'll give you a gun. Come on, man. Just 30, 30 bones, please. 30, please. I just want to make myself a bone club so I can, like, get myself set up again. I mean... Oh, okay. That, 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 that does the job as well. Th thanks, man. Uh, I'll be forever in your debt. Whoa. Holy crap. Oh, wow. You're, you're, you're a very kind soul. Ho oh, ho. Thank you, dude. This, this will help. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're, you're, you are a very great person. Thank you, friend. Well, great guy. See, this is what you need more of. You need more. What the fuck? Bone clubs are, I think, better for gathering than, than rocks. They're much faster, and you only, I think you lose out on, like, one piece of wood when you hit the tree, so you get a lot more, a lot faster, I think. I could be wrong. Maybe it's slower. Who knows? Because I sure as hell don't. It looks like we're going to have to be uh, selecting this area as, like, where we'll try and set up a base. It's not really where I'd like to choose, but we kind of have to make do with what we've got, really. Uh, we don't have much choice in the matter. We're living off the scraps, and of course, the guys who killed me might actually kill me again. They probably won't realize it's me when they see me all uh, kitted out in a bone knife. Let's make a hatchet, I guess. Then we'll make a pickaxe after that. Afterwards, there you go. It's sort of hidden from view. Nobody will know it's there, and uh, they're gonna be really scared when they realize what was happening. There's actually a sleeping bag there that's uh, actually about to fucking destroy them. Holy shit. Sad that we have to kill these majestic creatures, but um, they are in my land, and so they die. I'm gonna make myself some uh, leather leather clothing here. Should hopefully stop us from freezing to death in this uh, snowy wasteland, especially when it becomes nighttime. It'll probably get pretty cold out here. Uh, we may have chosen like one of the worst places uh, to build a base, but I think we're gonna do it. I think we're going to do it simply because it's remote. People, not many people come to a snow biome because of the fact that it's so fucking cold. Uh, so we're going to have to probably struggle to survive out here, but um, I think it'll be worth it for the the lack of people, you know? We'll live in the snow like some sort of uh, yeti, and then we'll come out and scavenge, kill people like a polar bear, except in human form. That's what we're going for. A uh, polar bear in human form. Uh, I, think I'll, I think I'd make a pretty good polar bear, to be honest. So uh, that's what we're gonna be, we're gonna do. We're gonna be the best polar bear you've ever seen. Except we're not gonna look like a bear. We're gonna look like a human being, a man. Well, a woman in this case. I am actually a woman. Um. So, all right. Well, we've got ourselves a building plan. So I'm gonna lay down a tool cupboard. I think we're gonna build it just about. Where do we want to build a tool cupboard? I think we want to build it down here. It's like nice and flat area here that we can build like a tower. We're gonna build like some sort of yeti tower, right? Do, do yetis live in a tower? I don't think so. I think they live in a cave. Do yetis even exist? I don't know. I'm not the, the smartest when it comes to uh, the existence of yetis and the studies surrounding that, that field, but um, you never know, right? You never know. There could be a yeti. The, the, the yeti could be hiding among us. Your own family could be yetis, and you wouldn't even know. Like, polar bears that walk on two legs. I mean, polar bears do walk. They just usually walk on uh, four legs, because they're bears. You know, they don't usually take the two-legged approach like humans do. Nope. They are bears. So that's all I really edited. Um, that's probably the best stuff that happened. It got pretty boring after that, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, like I said, um, thank you guys for the tremendous amount of support recently. And I will be recording more trap-based stuff and solo survival stuff coming uh, on the wipe uh, this Thursday. Uh, until then, I might upload some Player Unknown Battlegrounds. 
um, potentially, I don't know, uh, or I might do like another live stream or something. But uh, yeah, that's 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 really it. Uh, I'm sorry this is such a short video. It's just I wanted to put something out, and this was all I really had that was worth uploading. So uh, there you go. <laughs> Thank you guys uh, for watching, and I will see you next time.